God takes care of his people. That's the subject of today's Higher Things video short. Hey, if you love our videos, if you love what we're doing in Higher Things, pass it on the faith to the next generation, like our videos, subscribe to our YouTube channel, ring the bell for notifications, get the app. It's on every major device, iTunes, Android, Amazon, soon Roku and, and uh, Apple TV. Donate. Your tax-deductible gift to higherthings.org keeps us, passing that faith to the next generation, keeps us rolling, and we need your gifts in these dark times. Last, yesterday's gospel lesson in the traditional series saw Jesus feed 4,000. Now remember, a chapter and a half earlier, he fed 5,000 with five loaves of bread and two fish. This time he feeds 4,000 with seven loaves of bread and a few fish. Fish po' boys for everyone. Well, what does that have to do with us today? How does that help us in the situation that we're in? Well, the big deal here is that God feeds his people. God cares for his people. If you're, if you're having a rough go of it, and I don't know why you would in a world gone crazy, the, the key here is to remember the God who made you gives you body, soul, eyes, ears, and all your members, your reason, and all your senses, and he still takes care of you. He didn't just make you, but he made you, and he cares for you. He feeds you. He provides for you. Now, he doesn't always provide for you in the way that you want to be provided for. Um, you may not be on lifestyles of the rich and famous, uh, but he's going to take care of you. See, and you know this not because of personal experience, not because not because of what's going on in your life. You know this because of the suffering and death of Jesus. In Christ's death, you see his compassion. In Christ's holy life and bitter sufferings and death, you see the God that is so for you that he becomes you, takes on your flesh to die. That's the certainty. You died with him. You rose with him. You live with him. That's the certainty that you go through this life in. And just as he raised from the dead on the third day, you're going to raise from the dead. So if times are tough, if, if the financials are a little rough, if you look at your situation and go, I don't have enough to pay my bills, or I, I, I don't have enough as much as I used to, or, or you're afraid that you're going to lose your job, the place to look to is the suffering and death of Christ. Because in his suffering and death, in his faithfulness, you will find comfort. He fed 5,000 with, with 12 baskets of leftovers. He fed 4,000 with seven baskets full of leftovers. He's going to take care of you too. He's going to take care of you. You know that because of Christ and his death for you. I'm Pastor George Borkart. He just flat out missed that. And this has been another Higher Things video short.